still three in one, but we have a showstopper, and it is right here. If you only buy one item from this particular hour, I'm gonna recommend it is this one. It's the Chopped Speed Grater and Slicer. Um, I was watching HSN a lot yesterday, which is why I saw Kelly with the uh, popcorn maker and why I saw John with this. <laughs> John, I watched you do it, and I've seen you with so many different slices and dices and right. choppers and shredders. This makes so much sense. It's and so for easy. $39. Yeah. <laughs> tell me how it works. Let me tell you, you've got three different drums, okay? I'm using the slicing drum right here. And then you've also got the coarse grating drum and the fine grating okay. drum. Okay. So only three drums, it does just about everything. I mean, all you do is turn the handle. It's got a pusher, okay? A little plunger up here on the top that yeah. pushes the food down through the chute. Yeah. Your fingers never get close to the cutting blades. So if you've ever slipped on one of these, oh you're really gosh. gonna appreciate the speed grater. <laughs> and so it, everything comes out right through the, the top of the uh, drum. So, I mean, you can do mounds of food in minutes with this little machine. I'll show you a couple of quick features though that make it different than anything else I've seen. This has a little knob on the side, okay? So any flat countertop or tabletop, all you do is set it down. Twist the knob and it's locked. It's on there, solid, right on your countertop or tabletop. So you don't have to chase it around like other machines. Now, the drums, they come out very simply, okay? So for cleaning, all you do is take that to the dishwasher, rinse it off like a knife in the sink, however you wanna clean them up. Right, right. The handle is the key, okay? You'll see right here, there's a little tab on the back of the handle. That's a spring-loaded tab that goes up, pops up and down. Right. So when you put your, uh, whatever drum it is that you wanna use, so if you wanna do a slicing, you put the slicing drum in, the handle locks the drum in place. So you listen, and you'll hear it click, listen to this. Okay. I heard Once it. you hear that click, it's ready to go. So you can take uh, whatever it is you want to slice. Maybe you want to make bread and butter pickles or slice cucumber for cucumber and onion salad. Right. Maybe you want to nickel down carrots for canning or slice oh, beets goodness. for pickling. This machine does it quick, safe, fast, and easy. And when you get close to your fingers, you never, you don't even have to stop because you've got that pusher that pushes the vegetable through. There's an entire English cucumber sliced perfectly in seconds. I mean, it does. It's, listen. Cooking doesn't take time. Right. It's the, the preparation prep. that takes all the time How in the kitchen. That? So I mean, when you can do your veggies this quick, safe, fast, and easy, it just saves you so much time. And time is money. Well, I, I, if you've watched the TV show, you'll already know about um, how efficient, how effective this is going to be. Um, chefs worldwide tried and true and tested. For many folks who watch us, and you see the other machines and devices out there, some of which you have to press right. down, some of the which you have to slide. This is one way you just you you just literally spinning that handle you're cranking right. that handle easy and simple it requires absolutely no effort whatsoever it's just easy breezy I, I'm for me and my money doing this job every single day <laughs> and I see different products you know some products stand out more than others this to me is this is gonna be probably one of the biggest sellers you've ever had John it really you know Don't it you saves think? you so much time it, it's the time that it saves yeah. you Adam and yeah. yes you're right it's one of the most popular machines because it's so simple to use I mean, I mean, zucchini for zucchini bread or zucchini muffins. You can grate sharp cheddar cheese, Parmesan cheese, carrots, coconut, chocolate. All you do is twist the handle. It's like a hurricane of, uh, yeah. of grating coming out of there. And there's an entire bowl of zucchini oh, and, squash, and yellow squash done literally in seconds. Right, now, right. how about this for breakfast? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna put another bowl in the front. Now you can do this into a salad bowl. You can do this right into, you just slide the bowl or plate right in front of the machine. And I'm gonna take a potato because for hash browns in the morning, you're gonna love this machine. You can grate hash browns, like a, like a, again, like a hurricane. Look <laughs> Like a potato that. just went through a hurricane. <laughs> Look at this. All you do is push down, turn the handle, and the machine does the work for you. See, everything comes out of the drum right down here into the bowl, and now you could do that right into, I'll give you a little tip here too. I always have a bowl of cold water that I do my potatoes into, right. because the potatoes, uh, they have starch in them. Right. The water soaks the starch out so they don't stick together and clump oh, up in the morning, okay? Nice. So it separates all the pieces, so when it goes in the frying pan, it comes out crispy and golden smart, brown. Smart, very smart. Yeah. I wanna tell you the colors real fast, because the white is selling like gangbusters right now. There's white, we also have this red, and we have the gray down here. Each of them are accented, the gray and the red, uh, so the gray and the um, white are accented with the black, and then the red is accented with the gray, they look wonderful. They get you get all the attachments with it. Easy and simple. What about cleaning, though? Oh, here's. Yeah, I, I think. Listen, if a kitchen tool is hard to clean, 
you'll never you'll use never it. You'll never use right? it. That's the best part about this, okay? You take the handle off, the drums come out. Right here, you'll see a little red collar, okay? That collar locks the top on. So you turn that collar, the entire top comes off, that goes right in the dishwasher, or you can rinse it off right in the sink. Right. It's easy to clean. And then to put it back together, the base, by the way, the, you'll never have to clean this. And again, it sits right on the countertop or tabletop. You lock it into place by turning the handle on the side. And again, it's by the iconic chop, yep. okay? Yep. We've seen the television program with world with chefs worldwide. You sure. Uh, they, the, all of our tools are designed and used by world-renowned chefs. And the reason that we bring them here is because they are the best in the world. Yes, they are. Now, and because they save you so much time. Now, I'm gonna show you this real quick. I'm gonna put the fine grating blade in, okay? I, we haven't shown you this one yet. And the reason, well, the reason I love this one so much, I do a lot of baking, yeah. all right? And take a look at this. I mean, for cracker crumbs, it takes some croutons, there's some stale bread. Here's some saltine crackers. All you do is turn the handle, and again, it's like a hurricane. It's like the, the food comes out like a hurricane. It really you does. Play, you can put as many in there as you can fit, and then all you do is turn the handle. Look at this. It does the work for you. Instead of, you know, I used to watch my grandmother do this. She'd put the, the crackers into a plastic bag right. and then take out the rolling pin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then beat up the bag yeah. with the rolling pin and then roll it over. Yeah. There's your breadcrumbs, okay? Your, your breadcrumb cra crackers done in seconds. Again, you can do that with saltines. You can do that with, oh, here. We've got a whole bunch of uh, graham crackers for graham cracker crust. If you do any baking at all, again, all I'm doing is turning the handle, the machine does the work for you. Those stainless steel drums do the work. When you get close to your fingers, again, Adam, if you've ever slipped on one of these uh -oh, things before, yeah. you're really gonna appreciate the fact that your fingers never get close to the cutting edges. So whether you're grating, uh, slicing, whether you're shredding, it does it all. Now, of course, no cheese or no grater would be complete if it didn't do cheese, right? right. I mean, look at this. Look at the amount of breadcrumbs that we just made. Uh, I'm <laughs> I mean, hypnotized and it comes by out this. Perfect. There's not a hump, a lump, a bump, or a chunk. I, I mean, it comes for chicken, fish, or meatloaf. That's yeah, a perfect yeah, yeah. breading. Now, watch the difference though, because for cheese alone, I think you're gonna love this. I've got some uh, here. One of the hardest things to, to do with a regular grater is great hard cheese. Right. Well, look at this, Adam. All I do is turn the handle, and again, this is hard Parmesan cheese for your Italian dishes. You'll love it for uh, Romano, for cheddar. And, uh, and again, this is the fine blade. When you get close to your fingers, you never have to worry about busting your nails or knuckles. And look at the, look at how it comes out of that machine, just like, like, it's, like I said, it's like a little tornado or a hurricane of cheese coming out of there. Look at the amount. That was an entire block of Parmesan cheese done literally in what, what like 10, 15 uh, seconds? <laughs> John, John I, I am hypnotized by this and it looks like our viewers are as well. Uh, in these final five minutes, if you want the red or the white, they'll be the first two to sell out. We're now just about 50%. Oh, 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 oh whoa, wow. whoa, whoa, hold on. The red, the red has blazing a trail. There's only a couple hundred left in red. We're nearly 50% sold out of the entire collection. Um, it's the lowest price we've ever done at $39.95. It is on five flex pay of $7.99. I know whenever we bring something new into our homes, into our kitchen, into our uh, routines, we're not certain we're gonna like it. Give this from chopped seven days, 20 days, yeah. 30 days. If you don't love it, of course you can return it for a full refund of the purchase price. Stood here with John, I can see why the reviews are all so positive. The work <laughs> is taken out of it. If yeah. you've got arthritis or dexterity problems with this, you just twist the handle. There's no effort required. No, there really isn't. And it does so much work. Even the, get the kids involved. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. On taco night. Next time you're having taco night, here, I'm going to take the fine blade out, the fine drum out. I'm going to go to the coarse blade and you snap that handle. Now listen, you'll hear that handle click. Yeah. Okay. When you, know you hear that in. click, you know it's in there. And now for tacos, enchiladas, burritos, tostadas, all you do is turn that handle and it's, again, it's like a tornado of cheese coming out. The kids can get involved. They can do it now, help out with the cooking, or maybe, you know, it could be your husband. or yeah. <laughs> you know, Get the guys involved. <laughs> and again, you never have to worry about your fingers, nails, or knuckles because you've got that pusher that feeds it all the way through to the end. Now, I will give you a little tip here, Adam, okay? Every once in a while, when I'm doing cheese, because it goes so fast, sometimes the drum kind of gets loaded up with cheese. Yeah. All you have to do, if it does that, you take this out, 
and just give tap it a tap it. like sure. that. It'll clean it right out, no problem. But look at this. Look at the amount of cheese that we did for your pizza toppings, for tacos, tostadas, enchiladas, and burritos. Now, oh, by the way, here, this is one of the best parts that I think the kids love, my kids love this. They do it all themselves. Now, yeah. the, what I'm gonna do is change it out. I'm gonna go to that coarse grater, okay? The one, same one I just did the cheese Listen with. The click. Watch this. Take some peanuts. Pour it in the little, little chute in the top. Yeah. You can use almonds, cashews, walnuts, whatever you like. Take some M&Ms, put right. those in the top. And now for your ice cream toppings, for cakes, pies, for your dessert topping, oh all you do God. is turn the handle, and look at this, you've got instant de dessert toppings that the kids will absolutely love. <laughs> I mean, Milkshakes, ice cream. Yeah. So now you can sprinkle this right over the top of your ice cream sundaes, you can, you can uh, uh, top off and decorate your desserts and pies, and again, the kids get involved in the kitchen this way. It's a uh, perfect way to do that. I, I am I'm, I, I hypnotized, <laughs> we have less than four minutes, everybody, less than four minutes if you'd like to get in. Um, I think you're gonna really love it. We're, we're gonna keep on showing you as much as possible. I would be I would be hesitant to normally say this, but I am going to say it. If you only buy one item in this sh in this hour, right. without question, it <laughs> should this. be this. Without question. That was a full block of chocolate. Okay. <laughs> For your uh, here, here, let's do some white chocolate this time. We'll mix it up a little bit. Okay. A chunk of chocolate like this for your dessert toppings. Maybe you want to top off a latte or a uh, or maybe it's a hot chocolate or a hot cocoa. Yeah, yeah. All you do is turn the handle and you've got that chocolate grated down to a perfect grade. Look. Now, at that. You can of course the, the same thing happens, but what here? Watch this. I got to show you this. I'm going to pop this out. Okay. We're going to take the grating drum out. Yeah. I'm gonna go to the slicing drum and watch the difference with the same chunk of chocolate, okay? Now you're gonna get a different result. Okay, for those, uh, for pies, you get your chocolate shavings this way, okay? So, I mean, what machine do you have? Those two, three, four, five, six, eight hundred dollar uh, big, you know, expensive food processors that sit up on the top yeah, shelf in the yeah, garage yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> because they're so many parts and pieces and they're so hard to set up and clean. Look at this. This does more than what, what I mean, you couldn't do that with most of those machines. And now you've got the tools to do this, safe, fast, and easy. And again, you're never getting your fingers next to those really, you know, the sharp edges like you do on these old four-sided box graters. We're gonna send you everything John's showing you, including the slicing drum, the medium grating drum, the fine grating drum, the food pusher, the suctioning base. Remember, the reason why this isn't slipping and sliding everywhere is because you simply attach it to the base. It That's suctions right. down. It is brilliant. I'm all for kitchen gadgets that we're actually gonna use rather than live in the cabinet. This we're gonna use and we're gonna love it. Okay, let's let's do a, a little, we've got 90 seconds, Mark. Yes. I, I, oh. Mark, John, John. Well, what do you Mark want? Mark next. I'll tell you what, here, again, I'm gonna do, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put the slicing insert in, okay. right, the slicing drum in. I'm gonna snap the handle on, remember it's got a click. Now I'm gonna take a potato. I'm gonna put this bowl in the front, let me get the chocolate out of that bowl real quick. Chocolate and potatoes. Look at this. Hey, how about homemade potato chips? Potatoes are gratin, scalloped potatoes. Remember, we does the grating coarse or fine, and it also has that slicing drum, so you can sit there, and here, maybe you wanna slice up, Yes. How about some celery? Why not? How much time does this stuff take? Look at this. You can do two, three, four stalks at a time if you like. All you do is turn the handle. You've got your sliced celery for soups, stews, for barbecues. I mean, this machine does more work than those heavy, expensive electric machines and it's not like those old box graters, like grandmother's old four-sided tin can right, grater. Right. Now it does it all right into a bowl, safe, fast, and easy. And again, do these potatoes I'm gonna make some more potato chips because I, I love these things. <laughs> do, these, do these into a bowl of cold water. So the water, again, remember the water soaks the starch out of the potatoes. Those potato chips, after they sit in the water for about 10 minutes, they curl up and get hard like a regular potato yeah, chip when you yeah. open up a bag yeah. of potato chips. And it soaks the starch out. So you can put those on a cookie sheet in the oven, sprinkle some Parmesan cheese or barbecue salt over the top. They're delicious, baked instead of deep fried. And they're better for you that way too.
But <laughs> just for that alone. And again, it doesn't matter if you do any can Hey, listen, it's coming up on summertime. We're going to have our summer vegetables yeah. out. Go, to, go down to the, uh, to, to the veggie, uh, you know, the, the uh, uh, market. Yeah, the veggie market. And listen, farmer's put, market. The farmer's market. Put away your uh, cucumbers for cucumber salad or bread and butter pickles. Nickel down carrots for canning. Slice beets for pickling. I mean, all you do is turn the handle. It does everything but the cooking. And again, cooking doesn't take time, Adam. It's the preparation. It's the preparation. That takes the time. I get Thank so excited. Thank you so much, John. That was brilliant. <laughs> Just br we have a lot of fun here. Really you know? a brilliant device. Um, stay right there for your chop speed grater. Check out all of our specials online at hsn.com and enjoy up to 65% off. If you are ordering anything, always the quickest way in is through the HSN app on the mobile phone or your tablet. Stay with us. Our grand finale is next.